Hey everybody and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Kingdom Hearts. In the last episode we opened this door over here that I'm standing in front of. This big black one that goes to the lift stop. You'd think it'd go to a slightly more epic place, but considering it was like a pretty hard door to open. But no, it just goes to the lift stop. Uh, we're going to take this platform here. We'll investigate the other places later on, but right now it goes down to some secret items. Uh, if we have around here, there's some Heartless. Don't have to kill them if you don't want to, I won't, because I'm feeling overleveled as it is, so, as I pretty much say every episode. I'm not sure why I'm quite so overleveled, considering I've not actually pretty much done any grinding in this game, but, you know, whatever. Uh, one of these platforms should go to the dungeon, it's this one, we're going to step on that one and go down. Uh, we've been down here with Beast before. This is the room that had the blue trinity in it. Fortunately, now that we have Donald and Goofy with us, we can actually activate it. Yay! Don't go through the door because that would be bad because then we'd have to come back in here and then all the hearts would respawn and that would be bad because that would waste a lot of time. So there's some enemies in here. Um, I can't remember if there were enemies last time we came in. I think there were, but I don't think they were quite this evil. Uh, so Blue Trinity is on the floor here. Tr Blue Trinity is Trinity Jump, obviously, so let's just jump on the spot and get a mega potion and some more items so I think this one's pretty much well worth it. You get a cottage and a mega ether as well plus all your health back, well some of your health back. Screw Donald and Goofy, they don't need their health back, they're gonna die anyway. Uh, but then we're gonna head back up to the waterway I think it's called, I think this area is called the waterway. Uh, and we're gonna go... Uh, where does this one go? Lift stop. Let's try Let's try going on here. I can't remember where it goes but let's try going on anyway. Yeah we're exploring! It goes to a completely sealed off corner. What does this crystal do? It makes an item appear. That was totally pointless. Okay, let's head back down. <laughs> I love how they just put these random areas in that have completely no point. But you can get some MP balls, which you don't even need, but okay. Sweet! <laughs> so we're going to head back to the lift stop now, back to the door that we opened with the puzzle pieces. Uh, so, is, oh, except we can't get back there until we've, no, oh, okay, wasted all our MP apparently. No, we can't get back there until we've killed all these enemies because we have to examine the crystal, and apparently you can't examine a crystal if there are heartless around. Because Sora is not good enough to multitask. Anyway, in terms of this episode, we're probably going to get about halfway through Hollow Bastion because this is a pretty big place. It's pretty, uh, there's a lot to explore. Well, not really a lot to explore, but it's, uh, there's a long way to go. And um, because of that, it's probably going to take a couple of episodes. I'm actually quite surprised at how little I'm able to fit into episodes anymore. Like, um, hang on. Uh, let's activate this crystal over here. I think this is a changeover crystal. Yeah, this is a changeover crystal. It changes where that, that um, thingy goes to. That lift goes to, jeez. So we're gonna go. So I'm gonna actually take this lift again. I think this one goes to another secret item. Another secret little random hidden corner of the lift stop. Is it? Yes, it is. It's just a Gravira chest, uh, which contains an Oracalcum. We're getting loads of Oracalcums. In fact, I just want to check something quick. Uh, how are we doing on Trinities? Because um, we should be pretty much to the end of. Oh, we finished all the red ones, all the green ones, all the yellow ones. So we've just got one more blue one, which is in Hollow Bastion, and all the white trinities. So um, we should be done with those pretty much, pretty much soon. We have to go back to every world to do all the white trinities, but that that should be uh, we should be able to do that after Hollow Bastion. So speaking of uh, other worlds, in fact, once you finish Hollow Bastion, all the other worlds, all the uh, enemies in other worlds become stronger. So you'll probably want to do things in other worlds before. Like, you finish Hollow Bastion. These enemies here are Wyverns, and they're a new type of heart we've not seen before, and they are evil incarnate. Like, seriously. They will just hang around the edges of platforms and just wait for you to try and attack them, then move back. They will just trick you into jumping off. And if you jump off here, you end up back in the waterway, which is where we went with Beast. Obviously going that far back is absolutely horrible. Like, no, 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 don't fall off. <laughs> so, you really don't want to fall off. That's just, just getting that across. We really do not want to fall off. 
Uh, this glowy switch activates the other platform that's here. We activated the other platform like when we were over at the other side. That's the entrance hall there. I'm trying to orient you, but I don't think I'm doing a particularly good job. Uh, I think we're going to use this pl Can we glide over there? I don't really want to risk it, in all honesty. I really don't want to risk it. Let's, I'll risk it now. <laughs> I'm not waiting for that to come back. Uh, if you glide over here, you can find a chest. Uh, I'm not sure what's in here. This will Don't target the... Don't try and open the platform. Some Dalmatians. How are we doing with Dalmatians, actually? Because we should be pretty much coming up to the end of that as well. We've just got two more chests to find, both of which are still in Hollow Bastion again. Should be able to just glide over there. Let's just glide over to this platform, actually. And... No. We're going to stop. Because we, next we have to go over to that platform over there. And... See if we can make it with the glide. Yes, we can. Yes. Awesome. Then we can get on here. Then we can glide over here. You could wait for the platforms, but I'm being impatient and doing it a silly way. Because that's how I roll. <laughs> anyway. Uh, once you got that Oricalcum over there, there's another one over here. Uh, not an Oricalcum, probably, but certainly another chest. Certainly another little box that you can open with a holy G. Uh, we need to get back over there now, so I'm probably gonna, I'm probably gonna play this one safe and take the platform because uh, don't really feel like <coughs> <coughs> don't really feel like running all the way up again. Uh, there we go. That, that went a lot better than it's ever gone before for me. I will be honest. I've done this a few times now, and never has it gone that smooth. So, yeah, I'm getting the reverse LP curse at the moment, so that's uh, that's pretty good. Anyway, <laughs> uh, we're gonna head up here, and if you activate this, you'll go onto this ridiculously large platform, which will really slowly start to move. Uh, okay, it's not quite as slow as I remember, but it's pretty pretty slow. We're, we're going all the way over there, so. So I just gotta wait this one out, wait this one out, wait this one out. Hopefully, uh, hopefully it won't be attacked by Heartless randomly halfway through. You know that would be a pretty, that would be pretty much a pain. And um, but no, this lift looks safe. Oh wait, no, it's not. There we go. <laughs> halfway through, you'll get attacked by Heartless, obviously. To some wizards. Um, uh, is he gonna teleport away? I don't care. Let's go after this one. Send all of you if you have to the other one. They should, they, should, they should be able to handle him. Pretty easy, pretty pointless. Once they're dead, you can just activate this and hooray! You've done it! Yay! Um, is this moving? Yes, it is. Very slowly again. Come on, let's just speed it up, speed it up, speed it up. Go fast. Move faster, platform! Uh, uh, come on. Then you'll also have to be teleported off the platform. Uh, if I remember right, there's a blue Tracy on the floor. I remember right! I am awesome! That's and I have it written down in front of me. But apart from that, I am awesome. <laughs> you can pick up a cottage off the floor here, and the other couple of items. Cottage, Mega Elixir, that kind of stuff. Uh, chest, obviously. With a Dispel G inside. A Triangular Dispel G. I'm glad I sold all those Dispel G's, because last time I came here, I did not sell any Dispel G's, and um, I couldn't pick any chests up, and it was kind of annoying me. Uh, now we're in here, I don't think there's actually anything to do here except examine the crystal, so let's examine the crystal! Yay! Yeah, wow, look at how much time we got left. We might actually be able to get through this in an episode. I'm, uh, I'm, I'm not going to jinx it by saying we definitely will, but we actually might! <laughs> Uh, Oricalc on the left, and then we're going to come around here and activate this crystal over here. So now we just got a load of lifts in sequence and pointless sequence because they're just one after each other with not much side path at the moment. Uh, but when you get up here, this is where things start to get a bit side pathy because uh, hey, look, I'm going to jump off the world! Yay! No, I'm not. I'm going to glide over here. Uh, if you glide around here and then do a little spin in midair because I'm a bit too high you can glide into this area here which is a door uh, that's the best way I've found to get to it I don't know how you're supposed to get to it I assume you probably are supposed to get it that way I'm not sure but in here there's an item with a uh, thingy in it <laughs> that's all I can say today thingy it's just it's just it's got a thingy in it let's put it that way 
And then we're going to get that to float G, and then uh, there's actually no way back up, so we're just going to jump down. Yay! Fortunately, jumping down here doesn't take us quite as far back as the waterway. It just takes us back to this crystal here, which we can activate again to get up again to the place where we just were, where we glided to the place with the thing that we jumped off. Yeah! So over here, we got some more Heartless over here. More Pointless Heartless, Pointless Heartless. What are you? Are you a Pointless Heartless? Yes, you are. You die. I said you die. Thank you. Uh, Defender, who's going to be annoying and hit me with his shield, because he's evil like that. Aha! More Pointless Heartless, Pointless Heartless, you're dead. Pointless Heartless, I can kill in one hit, are uh, pretty pointless. I don't think I've said they were pointless enough today. Let's uh, just bring that down. And open that here for a Thundaga ring. And we'll use the crystal. No, we won't use this crystal. That's the wrong crystal! That takes us back down to the lower level. We do not want to go to the lower level. That is what you that is what happens if you examine that crystal. I just thought I'd make that pretty clear. Would you gonna um let's just rewind time here a bit and uh, head back up. Oh look, we're back up. It is in fact this crystal we want to activate, because this crystal is glowy red. And that will make that fall down for some reason. We can't walk on it though. <coughs> but that will uh, that will definitely have good consequences later on. Hopefully, I don't know, we, might, we might actually get through the rest of Hollow Bastion in this episode. Well, not, not the bosses, but... Oh, come on! How many times did I actually ricochet off that guy? We don't even need to kill these. Screw them. Screw you. Screw you, Boilers Heartless. You know. Screw you. Let me past. We, 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 we've, got, we've got a time limit to get through. We've got like three minutes left to get to the end of this place. More Pointless Hearts here, which again you've got to deal with, because there are other things to examine here. And you can't examine things if there are Heartless in the room. What's going on? There you are. You're glitching through the camera. Don't you glitch through my camera. I hate these enemies that can just randomly go invincible. Like, hey, look, I can kill you in one hit, but no, you're going to be an idiot and just go invisible, go invincible for a bit. Just so I can't kill you in one hit, so it takes even longer to kill you. Yay, I love fights like that. <laughs> anyway. Uh, chest up here. Let's get this one. Are you Dalmatians by any chance? I think you're Dalmatians. I think you're Dalmatians. Just one Dalmatian chest to go. Uh, here is the other crystal to activate, and that will take that one down. So I know I can actually climb on these things to get to the top level. Uh... And then, I think we use this crystal over here. Ah, oh, haha, I, I examined it before you spawned. I win, I win, ha <laughs> I win by default. Yeah. Uh, I love tricking Heartless. Uh, but anyway, you've got to fight the Heartless up here anyway, so. So it was a small victory, but I think, uh, I, think a, I think a noticeable victory. I think I'm happy with that victory. <laughs> anyway, up, up here you can find a chest. The Mega Elixir, and over here you can find a crystal that will do something. And that's what I'm talking about, like, l last episode, was it? Was it really only last episode? Oh my god, it actually was only last episode. That we can come back, we, c we could go all the way back down Hollow Bastion to get that chest, but we won't be doing, we'll be getting it next time we come to Hollow Bastion. <sighs> anyway, now we've done that, we can just head through here head through here, and we end up in the castle chapel! Wow! So, I see the path has emerged at last. Yes, the keyhole to the darkness. Unlock it, and the Heartless will overrun this world. What do I care? The darkness holds no power over me. Rather, I will use its power to rule all worlds. Such confidence. Oh. Ah! Impossible! The princesses of heart are all here. It must be her. 
without her heart. She will never be able to release her power. The King's fools are here. I'll deal with them myself. You stay here and guard the princesses. <laughs> 